As a man, your attractiveness isn't only controlled by your physical appearance, but what you do physically, by what you do with grooming, what, what, or even by what you buy or put on. A lot of it comes intrinsically, especially when it comes with women. See, women will judge you by what you have inside, and today, I'm gonna show you how to become attractive with the skill sets that you own. Hey, these are seven skills any man can learn that are gonna make you more attractive. Let's hop into it. Number one, learning how to dress. See, you need to understand that dressing isn't just vanity. Dressing isn't just, oh, I'm dressing because I want to look good. No, 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 no. We as humans send about 70% of our messages non-verbally, which means you send messages with how you walk, how you act, and how you look without you even realizing it. And it's only those men that understand this concept and start dressing intentionally that they can then control the message that they send. So when you step into a room, if you wanna send a message of dominance, maturity, and as if you can get the job done, you're gonna dress professional. You're gonna dress and use clothing that sends that exact message to get the goal that you want to cross. If you're gonna go on a date and you wanna send a message of being friendlier, and, and, and sexual. And as if a dude that's trustworthy, you can use colors and certain fits that are gonna project and send that exact message to be able to connect with girls as you're doing so. The point is, once you learn how to dress intentionally, and the best way to do this, here, here's a secret, here's the best way. Ready? You follow your boy. You follow your boy, you hit subscribe, you become part of the family, because that's exactly what I do. Every single video is to show you how to dress intentionally. Number two. Learn how to make more money. Of course, we know this. Women do prefer men that are higher earners. Science has proved this over and over again. And the interesting part is that there is a direct correlation between the skills that you know and the money that you can ask for based on those skills. In other words, you need to start learning any skill people are willing to pay for. Because think about it, being financially independent, it's sexy. You don't have to depend on anybody. You don't have to be stressing over bills. And it also provides a sense of confidence. So whether it's photography, graphic design, website coding, website development, music engineering, marketing, these are all skills all of us can learn. You don't have to go to school for Matter of fact, you can learn on the side after your main job or after you're done with school. And on learning platforms like our sponsor Skillshare, they make it even easier for you to learn. See, our sponsor Skillshare is a learning platform or a learning community full of thousands of creators that are all like-minded like you. So when you hop on Skillshare, there's gonna be a bunch of other men and women in the same mindset as you that are trying to improve their skills across any of the subjects I just talked about and some. So the cool part is that when you join a lecture or a class, you're gonna feel the room with, filled with other guys and girls within that same mindset that you can easily connect with. This is to ensure that it sparks creativity out of you and innovation and drive to actually want to learn, which is why learning on Skillshare is easier than ever. See, Skillshare provides premium content from premium creators that are experts in their field. So if you're learning marketing, you're gonna learn from an expert in marketing. If you're learning photography, you're gonna learn from an expert in photography. And since the content is shot in a premium format, it has no ads and it's all inducive for you to learn more. The point is boys, we're in a new year. That means that there's new possibilities and with Skillshare, you can realize these possibilities. Say you wanted to be a YouTuber, for example. There is actually a class taught by a high level YouTuber called Marcus Brownlee, where he's showing you how to shoot edit and film all your content from A to Z. Like anything you want to learn, you can learn. And here's the sweet part. The first 1,000 guys that want to take initiative of this year and learn a skill, you're going to get it for free. The first month of Skillshare Premium, you're going to get completely free, no investment whatsoever. So you can look at all their classes and see the immense amount of value that you can add to your year just by clicking that link down below. If you guys want to check out Skillshare, like I said, it's going to be linked down below. Check it out. The first 1,000 guys get the first month of premium free. Number three, you need to start driving like a man. No, I'm not talking about jumping red lines or revving uncontrollably or splitting traffic like a maniac. No, no, no. I'm talking about actually following road rules. A dude that's actually cautious of his own life and if you got a girl in the car of her life and of everybody else's life on the street, a dude that's not going to drive while they're intoxicated. See, involuntary manslaughter, yeah, that, that, that's just, that, that just doesn't sound too sexy, does it? If women want to feel protected and secure. You provide that security, gonna be more attractive. Number four, cook at least one good meal. Look, I'm not telling you to be Wolfgang Puck here, but I am telling you that you need to learn at least one good meal. See, women love this. Bro, you make this your first date, 
you will seal the deal with every single girl you go on a first date. Instead of going for a dinner and a movie, you bring her to your crib. You cook her the best pasta this woman's ever tasted. And matter of fact, she might even hop in and start helping you cook. It gets cute. You guys start wrestling together in the kitchen. You've seen the movies, boys. Then you feed her tummy with the best meal she's ever had. Then you guys go Netflix and chill like you. The rest is history. This is a done deal. If you can cook one good meal, it's game over. Number five, self-control. And I'm talking about across your life. Food, alcohol, drugs, women, pornography, partying. If you can have self-control and even the hardest of vices, you got control over your life. And that's sexy. Most men end up failing in life because they usually end up losing to one of these vices because they take control over their life. The smoking, the alcohol, the tobacco, the drugs, the pornography, the women. When you overindulge in any of this, it's going to lead down a bad path. But if you're able to control yourself and not waste your energy in something that can consume all of it and instead throw your energy into something that's gonna pay you back dividends, that's when you're gonna be successful and that's when it's attractive. Number six, I want you to start creating versus just consuming. We live in a world where consuming is easy. You order takeout on Uber Eats, you watch Netflix, then you go on YouTube, then you go on TikTok. All you do all day, if you think about it, is over consume content, information, and products, but you never actually produce anything. But what would happen instead of just spending all your day consuming, you made your own food, right? Or maybe you bought some Netflix stock, right? Or maybe you spend your time creating content for your personal brand. See, while consumption, it's a great thing, you need to also start thinking as a creator and be an owner of things. Start creating things. That's attractive. And finally, number seven, have a self-care routine. This is a skill all men should implement. And it's an easy one. You implement this in your daily life. Not only is it going to build healthy habits that you can build up off of, you're going to look better. If you implement these self-care routines like a skincare, like your hygiene, like your odor control, boys, you're always going to look like a stud and that's going to be irrefutable. And the interesting part is since most men aren't doing this, you're going to stand out from the crowd. Women will notice this. And that's basically it for this week's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to drop us a like down below. Also, boys, don't forget to check out our sponsor, Skillshare. They're going to be linked down below as well. That's it for me today. See you next time.